Hello everyone, welcome back to Trophy Travel Experiences. Today I'm doing a review of a flight I had between Montreal and Vancouver on Air Canada Flight 311 and the plane they use is the Boeing 777-300ER. I was in seat 6A but the seat next to me 6D was not taken so I got to film that seat also. I really like this product, um, it's a very comfortable seat and this is a one two one design so um, the window seat and then two seats in the middle and then one at the other end of the window seat um, so again very comfortable design um, and i enjoyed this plane short video of this seat beside me was in the middle 6d and then behind it 7d so fairly spacious and then the next video coming up is actually my seat which is 6a so I like that they have this uh, countertop. You can put a lot of things. That's the remote control, a little space for you to store. I actually like it. It's quite a good product. I've had this uh, many times. See this comfortable. Um, and it's got the controls uh, near you. This is quite nice. It comes out um, in a nice angle. So when it's out, um, it's quite a nice uh, large uh, kind of uh, surface but then you can also um, pull it back and it's undisturbing so um, I think it's a very comfortable product I enjoy this product and you can see the seat is uh, doesn't look like it's that cramped and it's got a lot of storage which I like this was an early morning flight, took off about 7.30 with the time difference, arrived in Vancouver at 10. So it is a five and a half hour flight. And so uh, it is useful to have a business class a seat if you wanna lie back, relax, or even take a quick nap in the morning. I had eaten um, at the lounge, Maple Leaf Lounge, and I did a video on that also. Um, so I wasn't that hungry. So I just had the, you have a choice of the hot breakfast or the cold breakfast. So I decided on the cold breakfast. It was early in the morning, so I didn't have any wine, but I'm just providing the wine list. Um, it's an okay list um, of the wines that I thought there was, uh, I'm interested in the uh, Cune Crianza Rioja wine. That's nice. Uh, I would have had that if it was, let's say a nighttime meal. I might have also tried the Argentinian uh, Malbec from Gotalari. Um, so those would be interesting wines, but this is not um, really, really for wine drinkers. As some of your viewers may know, I also have a channel, uh, Trophy Wine Hunter. Um, for, um, I guess, interested wine drinkers, this is would be kind of value type wines in the $20 range. So it's not really going to knock your socks off, but you know, if there was something that you haven't tried before, it might be interesting to try. So here's the uh, breakfast. So you have some emmental cheddar and cherry tomato and crackers. You have bread, butter, and jam. And the main dish is this chia seed pudding, fresh fruit and berry compote with coconut. Um, it's okay, uh, but I love the berry compote. So the berry compote was nice. Um, the chia seed pudding was uh, okay. I guess it must be healthy, so it's good for you, but I didn't have the whole thing, but I had the compote and that was nice. So uh, I would say that's just, you know, a meal. It's not, uh, you know, I don't think Air Canada is really known for its top end food or top end wines, but it's uh, okay. All in all, I thought it was a pleasant flight. I actually like the, um, Crew is always friendly in Air Canada. The seat is actually very nice. Um, the food is okay. Um, so anyways, hope you've enjoyed this review. Until next time, safe travels.